hello guys welcome to my channel in this video i'm going to show you demo about implementing expansion panel in dotnet mavi application so i have created one plugin uh, to achieve functionality like this so in a flutter uh, there is a uh, one uh, widget like uh, expansion panel so on the click of header it just uh, going to expand and just uh, display the content there and again on the click of uh, click of header it just uh, going to collapse the content so let me install that plugin in our project so for install it just uh, right click uh, on your project and click on manage new get packages and here search for plugin.mavi.expansion panel and install this plugin in your project okay so let me open project url also so you can see like how can i use this expansion panel okay so once it install uh, just add this namespace in your content page where you want to display this expansion panel so i am going to use here on main page so on the main page i am just adding this namespace now here in a header content property you can uh, design the header layout and outside of uh, this header content means uh, directly inside the uh, expansion panel uh, you just add the content that you want to display now let me add here so panel call an expansion panel okay so here in header content property now i can add here any layout so here i'm just adding label and outside of header content so here in a expansion panel i can add description okay so now let me run the application so on the click of header it is uh, going to display this uh, label tax uh, description and again on the click of header it just uh, going to hide this content Okay, so here on the click of panel one, it's uh, displaying the uh, description, and again on the click of that, it's hiding. So let me just add here. okay so now here also you can add scroll view like if you want to set some height of content and that will scroll so you can also achieve like this so here in a panel one and this will be content will be available in scrolling Okay, and here in header so header also header content property also is the type of view so you can design uh, any kind of layout here so you can set uh, 
okay you can set this border like this Okay, so let me rerun the application so it is uh, going to display a border radius. Okay, so now on the click of panel, it's a display, uh, displaying description. So you can add uh, like this multiple panel also on uh, one project. So like this, it will display content now let me add here image also so you can like uh, when the this panel is expanded so that time you can display uh, like up arrow icon here and when it uh, when it is collapsed that time you can display down arrow so whatever like uh, whatever the icon you want to set here so that also you can do it so let me add here these two icon down arrow and up arrow icon in a resources folder okay so here in header content inside this thick layout i'm just setting this layout as a horizontals and here i'm just adding image I am just uh, setting here trigger because this expansion panel has a one property is expanded so when it is true then I will set some icon and when it is false and that condition also I will set some icon So I want to access this expansion panel property so let me add here name so from this panel I want to access is expanded property and when it is true I will just set a arrow icon and similar another condition I am just going to add when it is false so I will set down arrow icon Okay, now let me run the application. Okay, so default it's uh, displaying down arrow. 
and when I click so it just uh, displaying up arrow okay now let me run this in a uh, windows uh, let's see it's uh, working on windows platform or not okay so here on the click of panel header it just expanding and displaying content here and again on the click of header it just uh, hiding content okay so this panel one is not working yeah let me check here on the click of label it's working but on the click of border here it's not working here it is working so after adding image uh, this situation arise let me add that same image here in other expansion panel Okay, so after adding that it's uh, stopped to work to second panel also uh, let me see with background color like how much space it's occupying okay okay so I don't know like uh, when I added a uh, background color here then it's working and <laughs> without background color it's uh, not working so I'm not sure why this behavior uh, let me just change to horizontal stick layout okay so for that also it's a Okay, so I'm not sure about uh, this one like uh, while it's uh, not working Okay, so that's uh, all for today. I hope you like this video and thank you so much for watching